Hey everybody, it's Orca. I have a really quick tip to share with you guys. Now, I play Flings a Roller, and I was playing a game a couple days ago. And in that game, I came across a Flings a Roller who I saw do something very interesting. This is the first tip is that if you are practicing this game seriously, you should steal strategies from players that you admire or that you uh, see that have done really well. So this was a player called Mitch. Shout out to Mitch. As you can see here, Mitch does this thing where he ledge sharks by doing two jump horizontal flicks over the ledge. Usually in my gameplay, I would only do one horizontal flick, but what I really liked about Mitch's approach is that it adds that much more consistency to the approach because you can get much more consistent splats if you just do two horizontal flicks instead of one. Because sometimes, as the Flings of Roller does that, uh, it doesn't do full 100% damage. In fact, I think I can show that here uh, very easily by just doing one of those horizontal flicks. As you can see there, it does 52% damage, which is not 100, right? But if you do two flicks back to back, then you get that 100% damage. And if anyone did not know how to do this, uh, all you have to do to get a jump horizontal flick is press ZR and then press B immediately after ZR, the button to shoot, and then B, the button to jump. If you do that in quick succession, you will get a jump horizontal flick. Now, that's not actually the tip I wanted to mention. The tip I'm going to mention is that I thought that you could only do this with horizontal flicks over the ledge with Flings a Roller because Flings a Roller's vertical flick the one that you get by pressing B and then ZR is really slow. So usually when you do this over a ledge, you can't actually hit what's on the ledge because the jump is too slow. But I actually found that there is a way that if you time it perfectly by pressing B and ZR at the same time, you can actually hit what's over the ledge. You can ledge shark with flings a roller, even though it's a slower roller. So this is the knowledge that I came across with, and you can do this consistently. Here's a clip of me doing it consistently here. As you can see, bam, come over here, bam, bam, and bam. So you can do this very consistently. Um, I hope that this helps you. If you like the video, please like, comment, subscribe. If you want more flings of tips in the future, I would be happy to give them. If you want more tips in general, uh, I'd be happy to give them. Please let me know if this is something that you would like to see more of in the future. Until next time, bye.